Hey guys, it's Caitlin Christine and you're Clashing with Ed. Enjoy the video. Hi guys, I'm Ed and you know me as a two star pony. Yes, and this is my YouTube channel. And guys, if you support me on Patreon, I give you their war base. And I'll give you a teaser push base. Yes, yes, that's delightful. A CBL slash ESL base and a regular push base. And then, of course, a farm base. And don't forget the builder base. And guys, you get these twice a month. So for $5, you get 12 bases. That's a good deal. And that's for supporting me because I love you guys. Check the link in the description. And uh, let's go and see the video. Oppa. Up, uh, guys, so I know what you are thinking. Yes, Yetis can, you know, do anything for any base. They are on, you know, they, they are just, if you use Yetis, you are the crazy attacker. So here is my base versus some Yetis. And you guys are going to see that Yetis, mm -mm -mm, Yetis have nothing on my base. Actually, that's the worst thing you can try to use on my base since, frankly, uh, Yetis disgust me and my bases are well according to that I don't want Yetis to come and triple my bases so yeah and also Yetis are a bit slow and complicated it's for the the weak at heart the unskillful but here we have an attacker that actually is skillful so let's see how he does because I have a feeling that my base will will give him a run for his money Okay, here we go. Warden's in. It looks like he's gonna get the town hall there, but does he go for the three stars? Yeah, this is something that it's a good plan in a sense. You go hop into the core, break it open, and then you are basically basically accessing everything at the base. But now comes the surprise part, actually. You ain't gonna go that far. You ain't gonna go that far because defenses, they are placed carefully in this manner that it's not gonna be a three star, not even close. And when you're pushing, this is what you wanna see. You want to see this type of action happening on your stuff. You're gonna, like everything, basically you could say under 80%. Two star is good and getting that one one star in there would be delightful for day, but 65 Whatever 66. Ah, oh, that is just a treat. Look at that You only lost 21 and that's good because if you guys I know the struggle of pushing and these are the guys that you want to beat in push the top guys They can't beat my bases check them out they can't even two star them link in the description check out i share these bases weekly these are awesome bases i share them for you guys link in the description go there get them now Upa. you are an attacker even half decent go to the 90 percent you're at plus 30 so you make instead of lose and that's kind of the whole idea of this this game is to well gain and okay let's see how kakaroto is gonna be doing this because he also made the mistake of selecting yetis when he started to attack and let's see how gus is gonna be doing this stuff it's gonna be it's gonna be intriguing okay there we go there we go oh he's gonna do a warden walk that is gonna last for a lifetime and then, yeah, yeah, it's okay. He can do the warden walk. We will, we will just, you know, maybe have some coffee meanwhile. And guys, check the link in the description. Get some bases. I share weekly bases. You'll always be running with the newest, the freshest bases out there. And my team, we do not copy internet bases. We create everything from our own from zero that's what we've been doing for over four years now actually more than four years six years and yeah that is why we rule the base game so want to get in hop to patreon want to stay with the internet bases or something that your friends just suggest or the group bases fine by me fine by me it's your choice but look at this wouldn't you want to be gus here when you push, you want to have a base that will is not doo-doo. And look at this. 
The whole problem with the bases that I do is for the attacker because they don't know how to attack them. It's an unusual design. It's not just something you can just go and attack like everything else and just spam and YOLO and YOLO. Well, you can, but it's not going to work out. You need to have a ton of skill to be able to compete against these bases and then you only have that 30 seconds to watch and plan your attack and that's why I like pushing. It brings the good out of people. It makes see who is a noob and who is not. And here this is going to be coming to an end here. So, yep, it's good. But look at this. This is what you want when you're defending. You want those low percentage two stars. Yes, yes, yes. That's what I want. Give me the one stars. Look, everything except the three star is good. But then these low percentage are nice. Oh, good job, my base. Oopa. Hey guys, it's Caitlin Christine. I want to give a big shout out to Ed and all of his Patreons for you guys supporting his creativity. Thank you so much and I hope you love the video.